The human body is a feat of years of natural selection and its complexity still stuns many scientists and medical practitioners to this day. Today we'll be discussing some interesting facts about different parts of our body and some other stuff you might not know. From the number of heartbeats each day, to your brain and how you use it, here are craziest facts about the human body. Hey guys, this is your host, American Eye. Now sit back, relax, and enjoy that video. Number 15, similar smell. You might hear that everyone out there is unique in their very own special way, and that seems to be right unless you're a twin. Apparently, everyone has their very own unique smell to them, unless you have an identical twin who will also smell like you. It wasn't enough that they already look like you, but they also gotta smell the same too. It must be impossible to tell some twins apart. Number 14, brain power. Have you heard of the misconception that we only use 10% of our brain? Yeah, this one is definitely false. We use all of our brain, and each part of our brain is very important in one way or the other. People who probably came up with this were some sick mad scientists. Although the human brain is quite mysterious in many different ways, many neurologists have laughed at this one. The whole plotline to the Limitless movie is just completely ruined for you guys. Some believe the origins of the myth came from teachers who wanted to encourage their students to learn more often. Whatever the case may be, all 3.5 pounds of your brain is useful. Number 13. Swimming and eating okay. We've all heard that you need to wait at least 30 minutes after eating before you can get in the water and start swimming. What are the possible consequences of this? Will the food actually make you sink to the bottom of the pool like a rock or what? Is there something about food being in your stomach that turns ordinary swimming pool water into hydrofluoric acid or what? Unless you're eating bricks, you really don't need to worry too much about this one. In general, it's good to eat about 30 minutes before exercising, but the worst thing you might suffer from is a side cramp if you ate something unhealthy. Number 12. Blood Cells Our blood cells are like automobiles driving through our arteries, and we have a lot more of them than you might think. If you took every blood cell in the human body and stacked it side by side, it would measure 100,000 miles in an adult, maybe even higher for some larger people. People have 1.5 gallons of blood, and it's thought to make up 7% of our body weight. Men tend to actually have more blood than women, but it can depend on various factors. Number 11. RH Negative Blood While we're on the subject of blood, this blood is extremely sought after by researchers. Some claim this is a trait of non-human origin due to the fact that there's typically a genetic problem with the birth of a baby. People from southwestern France and northwestern Spain, often known as the Basque, have the highest percent than any other region. Most humans do contain the RH gene, but the ones that don't fall into this category. There are groups of RH negatives online that gather in secrecy. Apparently only 15% of the population in the US have RH negative blood, and the rest of the world only has 7%. Since everyone else is RH positive, it's believed that these people didn't actually evolve from apes and essentially are human. Or could they be the original humans who actually splice genes with animals on Earth? There have been documentation of women with RH negative blood need medical assistance to reproduce with an RH positive person. Number 10. How to get taller Have you ever wished you were just a little bit taller? Well, it turns out that people are actually naturally taller without gravity pushing down on us all the time. Gravity is really what's keeping us down, folks. Astronauts have reported growing 3% of their own body height in a zero-gravity environment. So let's just say you're a 6 foot 1 person, if you grow into space, you would grow 2 inches and become 6 foot 3. It turns out that your spine freely expands in outer space, which wouldn't typically happen on Earth. Astronauts will return to the same size once they go back to Earth, and it's been studied before using ultrasound to get a better idea exactly how it happens. Number 9. Pregnancy Brain A lot of changes happen to the woman's body after they become pregnant. It also turns out their brain becomes smaller too. A recent study has shown that women lose gray matter in the areas of their brain that deal with compassion and nonverbal expression. This is apparently done in order to finely tune the brain to prepare it for motherhood. Scientists are saying it's a good thing though. It turns out it makes the mother's brains more properly prepared for the complex task of taking care of a kid. Number 8. Bacteriophage These little organisms are actually viruses that attack bacteria. So it's something even bacteria are scared of. The one in this photo was injected into an E. coli bacterium. The tail contracts and it punctures itself into the cell membrane of the bacteria. Scientists are hoping that somehow, these creepy little microscopic bacteria fighters can maybe be useful to some people in the future. 
These enemies of our enemies could be huge allies in the fight against disease on humans. Number 7. Gender Strength Gaps You might be actually surprised by how narrow the gender gap can get when it comes to strength. While men on average are about twice as strong in upper body strength, women can typically match if not surpass men in lower body strength with proper training. Men are normally just stronger due to being larger and more muscle pound per pound. Muscle mass may not be an important factor that's reliant on gender by any means, but it shows that women specialize in different areas such as squats and lunges in comparison to pull-ups and push-ups. Healthy Fats Another thing that confuses people when they're dieting is the difference between saturated fats and total fats. Don't get tricked by these too easily. There can be some very healthy food out there that is high in fat such as olive oil and peanut butter that won't actually make you fat. You can normally see on the label there is polyunsaturated fat and monounsaturated fat on some labels, and if you do, it's normally a good sign. You can find plenty of healthy fats in fish as well as the omega-3 fatty acid. People are actually taking fish supplement oils in order to get a healthy dose. The benefits of consuming this is better brain function, better reproductive health, increase in testosterone for males, and better heart health. Normally the only time you want to consume saturated fat is if it contains polyunsaturated fat and monounsaturated fats. Number 5. Strongest Muscles What do you think the strongest muscles are in the body? The quads, the glutes, the tongue? The strongest muscle based on its weight is the jaw, which can close your mouth with 55 pounds of force on the incisors and 200 pounds of force on your molars. The other muscles we mentioned were some of the stronger muscles you have as well. And for women, we could probably also add the uterus. The uterus starts off as the size of a pear and actually stretches to the size of a watermelon during childbirth. It doesn't get used too often until childbirth, so ladies, no flexing your uterus powers, please. Number 4. 4 pounds of bacteria. No matter how many showers you take, eat antioxidants, or clean your hair, you probably got something living on you, somewhere. The average human has an average of anywhere from 3 to 5 pounds of bacteria either living on you or inside of you. The interior bacteria makes up the majority of organisms, but the exterior ones still make up 10%. Here's an example of something that's actually living on you. Thanks to the invention of the microscope, we can now see up close images of disturbing things like this eyelash mite. They also live in your hair follicles, buried head down, chomping away on your secreted oils. If that wasn't already gross enough, they also reproduce on top of you. Don't worry, everyone has them though, and they're supposed to be beneficial. Number 3. The Heart The heart is indeed the hardest working muscle being put to use 24-7. It can pump out 2 ounces of blood every heartbeat and pumping out a total of roughly 2,500 gallons of blood each day. Your heart beats an average of 115 times a day, and it's only about the size of your fist. It relies on electrical impulses from the brain, but scientists have realized that they can make the heart pump without the help of the brain using their own electricity. The woman's heart is known to beat slightly quicker than the man's heart, and in case you were wondering, it is rare, but also possible, to die of a broken heart. Scientists have called it broken heart syndrome, and it's from a rush of stress hormones from a traumatizing event, such as breaking up or finding out that someone cheated on you. A romantic sting can be fatal when the stress hormone takes over the body. Should the other person be held trial for murder in this case? Number 2. Water Benefits A Slovakian proverb states, Pure water is the world's first and foremost medicine. And we kind of think they're onto something there. Drinking water will promote urination, help the performance of your liver and your kidneys, which are both vital for proper flushing of toxins. But seriously, no fancy toxin flusher is necessary. Drinking water will help eliminate those toxins for you. People might spend outrageous amounts of money trying to buy all kinds of products that cleanse their system, but all they really need is some fresh H2O. This is also much more natural and can detoxify your lungs too, especially since your lungs contain one of the highest percentages of water at 83%. You might be surprised that even your bones are pretty watery, coming in at 30%. By helping your vital organs, especially your kidneys, by staying hydrated, you can basically kiss those toxins goodbye. And number 1. Stomach Acid Not that you want to test this out anytime soon, it seems to be proven that stomach acid is capable of dissolving metal. This acid is essential for digestion of proteins in solid food. Without your stomach acid, you probably wouldn't be able to digest things such as meat, for example. The acid in your stomach is known to be a little bit overkill, and we know that it can dissolve a razor blade. Your gut makes about 1.5 liters of this stuff each day. Some may feel heartburn or indigestion after eating due to stomach acid. The majority of your internal bacteria is also found right there in your stomach. 